rebut some of the points made by the defendants, my lord. Yes, go ahead. My lord, uh, firstly, my lord, the defendants have uh, stated that uh, one of the counsels from our side tried to mislead the court by making certain statements, my lord. The statement made by my counsel, my lord, was there is there is no clarity as to whether from 1920 they are producing milk separators or not, my lord. My lord, if you read the paragraph they were stating, my lord, it merely says they were established in 1920, my lord, and they produced things related to milk chilling, etc., etc., including maybe milk separators. That is good here. My lord, also the inference was an educated inference made by my co-counsel relating to the fact that they might have been producing it later than that simply because they had asked for a license from us. A person who is producing a particular good, why would he ask for a license, my lord? My lord, if I am producing a good, I will produce it myself and compete with me. That is the spirit of competition, my lord. My lord, furthermore, my lord, they have uh, raised a contention as to with relation to, my lord, uh, the fact that we have, uh, bear, have uh, uh, brought in Bear versus NATCO, my lord, saying that since uh, Bear had an Indian subsidiary, the controller of patent had issued a license and the matter is saved. My lord, the difference over here is there is no clarity as to what is the nature of this particular subsidiary. My lord, if we see the RBI master circulars, my lord, there are restrictions put on the several foreign entities in India. If, my lord, I am a branch office, my lord, or if I am a project office, I have certain rights. If I am a subsidiary incorporated under a companies act, then I have certain other uh, things that I can do, my lord. But at that time, my lord, there are several foreign entities. For instance, my lord, those are governed as foreign companies under the companies act. For instance, my lord, a uh, uh, branch office, my lord, that doesn't have the right to produce, my lord. Furthermore, my lord, this import restriction or the restriction on the circulation of goods is not brought upon by ourselves, my lord. It is a government imposed restriction, my lord. My lord, also the fact that the points that they have brought out has made it amply clear, my lord, that they are trying to approbate and reprobate at the same time. Which is a old Scottish rule, common law rule that has passed the uh, test of time. My lord, a, 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 a particular party cannot approbate and reprobate at the same time. Furthermore, my lord, they have said that their alloy of open judgment should be treated as inferior. My lord, their reason for that is the judgment wasn't well reasoned and did not take into account statutory provision. My lord, kindly see my lord paragraph 24. My lord, they take into account the entire statutory intent behind section 10 of the civil procedure code before tendering this, uh, this judgment. They have taken into account how the play of section 10 a stay on a particular suit comes in and only after that reasoning, my lord, they have given this judgment. The honourable judges in the Supreme Court. My lord, so I cannot see why the defendants are pleading that this should be treated in. Furthermore, my lord, they have uh, spoken about Khode distilleries. My lord, that is a case of passing off, my lord. In my case, I have a uh, registered trademark. I cannot see how that judgment will be binding upon this court. What is your answer for uh, public advantage? My lord. On the ground of public advantage. Related to the uh, uh, product. Well, if you could please clarify your question, my lord. See, what they said is that you are not able to meet the demand. Regarding the demand, my lord. Right, my lord. So they are talking that is the reason why there should be compulsory licensing, my lord. My lord, the reason we cannot meet demand is only and only the fact that there is a restriction by the government itself. My lord, kindly think how helpless I will be. Regardless of the fact that the restriction is imposed by the government or my my lord, I'll I'll please uh, get your attention, my lord, to section 83, subsection 7, clause E, my lord. It talks about the patent or persons claiming under the my It is marked, my lord, in my copy. Patenty or person claiming under him, my lord, if we see the legislative intent behind that lord, my lord, that is to protect foreign companies such as mine who have been stopped by the government to uh, import their product. My lord, the I have a transporter, my client has a transporter reputation. And my lord, the fact is, if they ask for a license, my lord, that is the greatest the greatest vindication of the quality of our product. So they are trying to say that their 10 lakhs is efficient, my lord. That argument falls flat on their face, my lord. 
because we had asked for the licensing. Thank you so much, ma'am.